All right, welcome back to Central Valley Buzz, everybody. I'm your host, Chuck Leonard. William, let's bring in our next guest, Evan Faulkner. Hello, sir. How are you? Great. Nice to see you again. Uh, you're here to talk about something going on at Peeves, one of my favorite places in Fresno. Uh, it's called Savage Cinema Club. Yes. So what yes. is it? It's, uh, what it is is it's every month, starting in February, uh, going through this year, it's the third Sunday of each month. And what it is, is it's like a, a hybrid of a movie night and live comedy. So it's kind of in the vein of like Mystery Science Theater 3000 and Rift Tracks, where we project uh, a, a, a movie of uh, questionable quality on the screen, <laughs> on the wall. With questionable quality? What do you mean? Uh, B like movies? Movies like Roadhouse, Showgirls. Well, wait uh, a minute. Did you say questionable and then say Roadhouse? Oh. Dalton? Come on. You know, it's the throat ripping alone makes that movie uh, the classic that it is. What I mean to I like say, when he, I like when he buys the Riviera and it, it and you know, off the used car lot, but it ends up being great. Yes. <laughs> no, no, that movie is awesome. I, I I gotta say that like most of these movies are, they're uh, whether it's intentional or not, they're very entertaining movies. And so. Sure. What we do is we kind of spice it up a bit, where me and one or two other local comedians, we have a microphone, we do a little color commentary, I have a laser pointer, and uh, we also do drinking games oh. for those that oh. would like to join. Mm -hmm. For instance, uh, when Dalton ripped a guy's throat out in Roadhouse, finish your drink. So. Oh, at that point you have to throw one back. Yeah, anytime someone says, yeah, like that. Like for, um, for this month, on the 17th, we're going to be doing a little movie called Reefer Madness. Oh, Reefer Madness. Wow. Yes. Will, you, will you be out in back of peeves? <laughs> <laughs> For those that uh, yeah. I, I can neither confirm nor deny. Uh, but it is a, uh, uh, it came out in 1936. Very infamous anti-drug uh, This film. is the one where the girl jumps out the window after smoking a joint? And it's uh, and you can tell she's a rag doll when she hits the ground. It's uh -huh. Well, that stuff will make you into one, from what All I understand. Right. <laughs> <laughs> What's crazy about the movie is that in the it came out the year that marijuana was made illegal, and in the film it's it's portrayed as a violent narcotic, mm -hmm. and in my experience it's violent in that it makes you want to violently eat a whole cheeseburger yes. in two minutes. Yes. I mean that's just my the opinion. munchies. Yes. It is, so uh, we're gonna be watching that film and just throwing shade at it, just having a good old time. You're throwing shade at Reefer Madness. As, as the kids say today. What, now, what, what other movies have you shown starting in February till now? February we did Roadhouse. Uh -huh. That was like our pilot show. And how, how many people show up to this? Oh, about uh, 15, 20 mm -hmm. on average. So maybe after this, a little more, trying to get the word out. Uh, <laughs> maybe a little more after being here. <laughs> <laughs> it's just something unique that, like, I mean, I've done local comedy around here, and to be honest with you, I kind of got bored with just the whole, you know, doing the, the thing, and I love movies. I'm a huge movie buff, and so I thought this would be really fun is to just watch these movies with an audience and just, you know, it's participatory. It's almost like Rocky Horror Picture Show. Did you see that the, uh, you can now play the dark side of the moon to The Force Awakens? I don't doubt it. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's, it's a new one. I don't, this might be somewhere in maybe too much of this. <laughs> it would work. It would work. Um, I would not recommend watching Dark Side of the Moon with like, you know, Sophie's Choice or Schindler's List, though. That might not work quite as well. You are a comedian, aren't you? Uh, <laughs> that's what my mom says. <laughs> no, so this is the third Sunday, so this next one's going to be... Uh, the seventeenth, three for madness, this three Sunday. days before tw three days before four twenty. It just uh -huh. worked out that way. Okay. Um, next month is going to be that one's really going to be rough. It's Battlefield Earth with John Travolta. Oh no. And then in June uh, it's going to be uh, Footloose. Oh gosh, the the first one I hope. Every yes yeah. yes with the Baconator. Uh -huh. And then in July uh, we're going to watch Cocktail with Tom Cruise. Oh. Yes. Man, oh he man. traded in his F-18 for flair bartending at TGI Friday, so <laughs> it's gonna be very awesome entertaining. Flick. Yes. Now, did, 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 are people asking you for certain movies now at this point? Yeah, well, my mom actually suggested Footloose, and I was like, that was <laughs> that was a great idea. Thank you. Um, people suggest a lot of ones. Uh, the Room, that's a very infamous uh, bad movie. Uh, uh, Troll 2, Birdemic. 
Uh, the I Leprechaun really want, movies? Oh, God. Leprechaun in the hood. That's a masterpiece. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Leprechaun man. in the hood? Oh, yeah. It's a scene where a guy literally pulls a whole baseball bat out of his afro. I'm, I'm not <laughs> making this up. <laughs> And then the leprechaun shows up. Of yes, yeah. of course. All right. Now, now this, this is happening this Sunday. What time does all this kick off? Uh, it kicks off at 7 p.m. Uh, just for, I mean, obviously last month we did Showgirls. That was not a, a, a family event. Uh, Why but, not? Oh, I don't know. It, uh, it, it definitely. I That's got the girl from Saved by the Bell in it? Yeah. She helped a lot of boys through puberty. I'll, I'll right. give it that, uh, yeah. myself included. But, um, Easy Tiger. Yeah. <laughs> All, uh, but I'm, uh, these shows are generally going to be around, you know, kind of PG-13. Okay. So don't bring the younger kids. But if you're not easily offended, it's going to be a great time. Awesome. So. All right. Uh, Evan Faulkner, he's going to be at Peeves this Sunday night watching Reefer Madness. Reefer wow, Madness. How fun. Uh, Billy, you going to go? Yeah. All right. Hey, uh, thanks for tuning in today, you guys. I had a great time. I hope you guys did, too. Now, go out and be the best Fresno you can. Now, support your local businesses. Support your local artists. I'm Chuck Leonard, and I'll catch you tomorrow. <laughs> yeah.